Yeah, my opinion is right now we've got COVID and that's taking everybody's attention. And it should, because we need to be able to address that. And then we need to take the lessons that we've learned from COVID in terms of making long-term preparedness going into the future, right? There are mistakes people make. There's also new knowledge, so you have to make changes that go along. But we've learned a lot. And this pandemic, uh, the last time we saw something like this was 1918, right? So all the you know, things that were being done then, most people have forgotten about, yeah? So now what we have is that opportunity to say, here are the lessons, we can be really prepared much better, right? And I'll be talking about that tomorrow. Now, when I think about what are big city problems going into the future, climate. I think climate's going to be a big thing. And in terms of climate, you know, we need to think about how all the different sectors of city government come together, civil society, business, because transportation, you know, do you have exhaust that's adding greenhouse gases? Are you building with cement and steel that accounts for 20% of greenhouse gases? How are you organizing hospitals? right, because that's 10% of all greenhouse gases, right? There's a lot we need to do in terms of architecture and then also urban planning. It's not enough just to plant trees, that's important, but there's so much else we need to do. And then how is it that we get people working together? What are different ways? You know, it's one thing, a mayor has to listen to all the different people, but then has to be the decision maker. And so how do you get more deliberation so that people, you know, understand the tough choices that need to be made, right? Yeah. And that's, that's something that I think mayors throughout the world, you know, really have to wrestle with. You know, it, it's, um, it's less compelling when you say, you must do this, rather than, can we all come together? Or can you say, you know what, it's up to you. Not optional, but how is it that we can all work together? So those are some of the challenges. COVID, what are the lessons that we learn? The second, climate change, all the redesign and planning at many levels. And third, how do we do governance in order to make compelling and persuasive change? So this is my first time in Moscow. And, you know, you see pictures and, you know, it's uh, different particular times. But now that you're here and it's in, you know, right in front of you, it's such a beautiful city. And the opportunity to be able to walk around and see different sites and to go on the river in a boat and, and then to meet the people of Moscow. Just uh, really such wonderful open conversations that we've been having. So I, I wish I could stay much longer than this trip, and I hope to be able to come back to continue the conversations, but also just to enjoy the city.